Welcome back to the Red Carpet Reup. In today's video, we're diving into Charlemagne, the God's ongoing legal battle with Jessica Reed. Charlemagne's legal team recently won a dismissal of Reed's lawsuit, but the case is far from over. Reed has a chance to refile, and Charlemagne's team is pushing back hard. Let's break down the key points of this complicated and highly publicized case. In 2001, Jessica Reed accused Charlemagne, the God, whose real name is Leonard Larry McKelvey, of sexually assaulting her at a party in South Carolina when she was just 15 years old. Charlemagne eventually pleaded guilty to a lesser charge and avoided trial for the more serious accusations. Fast forward to 2022. Reed filed a civil lawsuit seeking damages, not only for the assault, but also for public statements Charlemagne made over the years. However, Judge Ona T. Wang dismissed the case last month, citing that most of Reed's claims were too old under the statute of limitations. But here's the twist. The judge left the door open for Reed to refile her case. If she can prove that Charlemagne made harmful statements about her within the past year, her defamation claims might still be valid. Reed's legal team is working on amending the original complaint by including new medical diagnoses and other facts, hoping to bring the case back to court. They argue that Charlemagne's alleged statements have caused ongoing emotional distress for Reed. Charlemagne's legal team isn't backing down. They're fighting hard to prevent the case from being reopened. Their main argument is that Reed's claims are time barred and don't fall under exceptions like New York's Adult Survivors Act, which applies to adult victims, not minors. Additionally, they argue that Charlemagne cannot be held responsible for statements made in a YouTube video by another channel, as he had no involvement in creating or publishing that content. His attorneys are also challenging the validity of Reed's new medical diagnosis as grounds for reopening the case. This case is far from over, and the court's decision on whether Reed can amend her complaint will be crucial. If allowed, it could lead to a new phase of litigation, potentially even a trial. However, if the court sides with Charlemagne's legal team, this could mark the end of a legal battle that has been going on for over two decades. Stay tuned for more updates on this story and let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update from the Red Carpet Reup. Thanks for watching.